What? No. How did this happen? Not to me. You're not gonna believe this. I just came downstairs, had my breakfast, had a solid poop, sat down here, and just want to swing some pine and play some MLB The Show 21. And this, this happened. I don't have any players. These guys don't even have a face. I can't go online with a team like this. It would be embarrassing. It'd be borderline racist. If only there was a way that I could get some baseball players for my baseball team. If only that existed. If only. If only. If only. If. Wait a minute! I have a cell phone. What's going on, guys? It's Troy Dan here. And today on MLB The Show, we need to get some players. And I've got the perfect way to do it. As some of you guys might know, I used to be a mayor. And when I was in that responsible position, I found many contacts. I have many abilities to reach people that I didn't even know. So the way this works is simple. I am going to ask baseball players to name three baseball players for me. And then I will get to choose which one goes on my team. All right, with that being said, let's get a hold of my friends. Just need to uh, get my credit card first. Why are you getting a credit card? I thought they were your friends. Shut up, Timmy. And just before we start today's video, I'd like to give a quick shout out to our sponsor, Pedal. Pedal is a credit card company that wants to help you succeed financially. And that's why the Pedal 2 card is designed to help you build credit. When you apply for Pedal 2, your banking history may be used to instantly create your cash score, which is a measure of your credit worthiness based on your income, spending, and savings. It could help you qualify for a Pedal credit card, even if you've never had a credit score before. The Pedal 2 credit limit starts at $500 and ranges up to $10,000. Their mobile app also makes it effortless to track your spending, making payments on time, which is a big one for me, and even managing subscription spending, which can be easy to forget. Pedal is partnered with web bank member FDIC, which issues the cards. As of today, the Pedal 2 variable APR ranges from 12.99% to 26.99%. Guys, start building your credit history. Check out my link in the description box below. Pedalcard.com slash Troydan today to find out more. That's Pedal with a T. Pedal. P-E-T-A-L card.com slash Troy Dan. And again, thank you to Pedal for sponsoring this video. All right. It is now time to get some baseball players. And it looks like I've already received my first response from Al. Hey, Troy Dan. Albert Pujols here. Hope you're doing well. I think the three players that I can give you would be Willie Mays, Hank Karen, and a stand the man musical. I hope you like it. God bless you. And our first player today comes from the Braves. He's the 1957 World Series champion, the 1957 NL MVP, three-time Gold Glove Award winner, and 25-time All-Star appearances. What? Hank Aaron. Is that a typo? That's a lot of All-Star games. That's a lot of seasons to play. And I am aware there is a better Hank Aaron card in the game, but you have to do single player to get it. So that's not happening. Regardless, this guy is pretty great. Hey, Troy Dan. Uh, thanks for the question. So you're making an MLB The Show fantasy team, and you want me to name three baseball players. Okay, here we go. One, you got to put Mike Trout in there. Probably one of the best ball players in the whole United States. Uh, and he's still playing at a very high level. Next person I would put would be, uh, yeah, I'd put Ricky Henderson. Ricky is a guy who's going to steal you a lot of bases, hit, a, hit, hit some home runs. He's going to get on base for you all the time. He's going to score a lot of runs. That would be my second guy. Third guy I would put in there would probably be Roberto Alomar. I think uh, he was, you know, with all the players I played with, I, I feel he was the best five-tool player that I played with. So there you go. And I wasn't biased. I didn't put myself in there. But uh, yeah, Robbie Alomar, Ricky Henderson, and Mike Trout, those would be three players that I would definitely have on my team. If you need an outfielder with some power and driving runs, hey, 
I could be that fourth guy. <laughs> okay, take care. Bye-bye. And we've got from the Los Angeles Angels. He is a three-time American League MVP, a two-time All-MLB first team, the Rookie of the Year, eight-time Silver Slug Award, and he's won the Hank Aaron Award twice. You already know he's baseball. It's Michael Trout out here, one of my favorite players in the the greatest, one of the greatest of all time. He's still in his prime, and apparently he's injured. I hope his calf feels better soon. Hey, Triton. This is Raleigh Fingers, member of the Baseball Hall of Fame, and uh, member of those great Oakland A's teams back in the 70s, and you got a hold of me, and apparently you are putting together, uh, I guess, your fantasy team. I'll tell you, I sit at the Hall of Fame every year and have dinner with a whole bunch of guys that I'd like to have on my team right now. <laughs> And it's going to be tough to pick three guys out of that group. But uh, one guy for sure, I mean, I've had dinner and I've had lunch with this guy. He's passed away uh, as Ted Williams. You you got to have Ted in there. Uh, he knew more about hitting than any guy I ever talked to. Another guy I would probably have to say is uh, uh, my first autograph when I was a kid. My first autograph I got was of uh, Willie Mays. And uh, I've, I've talked with Willie, too. And uh, being a picture, a pitcher rather, you um, got to throw a pitcher in there. And uh, golly, there's so many good ones. Um, you know, I was kind of a toss up between uh, maybe Bob Gibson and uh, my idol when I was growing up was uh, Sandy Koufax. I hope you have uh, good luck with that, uh, picking your team out. And I hope these uh, three picks that I gave you uh, give you a good start. So good luck on that, all right? New York Mets. He is a World Series champion, a two-time MVP, a Rookie of the Year winner, 24 times in the All-Star Game, and 12 Gold Glove Awards, center fielder, Willie Mays. We got baseball royalty out here today. Jesus Christ, look at this team. I also know there's a better car to this. Same thing. I'm not doing single player to get it. This one's going to be fine. And I just found out Willie's still alive at 90 years of age. That's a dub. Dub's in the chat for Willie. What up, Troyden? This is Kenny Lofton. I heard you on the fantasy baseball team, and you want me to name three players, no matter when they played, for you to start your squad. First of all, I want you to put on my man, Satchel Page. Second of all, I want you to put myself. And third, the almighty Ted Williams. So there's your three players from Kenny Lofton. There's your answer. Peace. His time on the White Sox, a six-time All-Star, four-time Gold Glove Award winner, and a five-time stolen base leader. 93 overall, Kenny Lofton. Kenny choosing himself. I'm not mad. I, actually, one thing I am mad about is that Ted Williams is not in this game at all. Did you know that? The, Satchel Page isn't either, but Ted Williams is not in the game. That's a farce. I'm going to sue this company. This is Jose Canseco, and this is for Troy Dan. It says, I'm making a major league, the show fantasy team. And I was wondering if you could name three baseball players from my squad. Doesn't matter who or when they play. Well, from my era, you got to have a pitcher. Most dominating pitcher that I saw was Randy Johnson. You got to have an offensive player, a power hitter. The most powerful, prolific player that I saw, right hand power hitter B, between, of course, Mark McGuire and Bonds. Um, another player would be one of the best all-around players ever that you would need, Ken Griffey Jr. So I would definitely start a team with those three guys. You cannot go wrong. Build around that. That is a super team. Take care, buddy. And we've got from the Seattle Mariners. He is an MVP, a 10-time Gold Glove Award winner, a 7-time Silver Slugger Award winner as well, and 4-time American League home run leader. One of my favorite players to ever do it. The kid, Ken Griffey Jr. Griffey, one of my favorite, if not my favorite player of all time. I got the games on the Super Nintendo, and Ken Griffey was the only player I could actually take out of the four that were given to me by Conseco. Randy Johnson, not in the game. Mark McGuire, not in the game. And Barry Bonds, not in the game. I mean, Randy, but why Mark and Barry? What do those two do? They were just big sluggers, huh? Troyden, what's up? Um, so you are making uh, an MLB The Show fantasy team. You want three players. So 
I would look at it like this. I would go pitcher, infielder, outfielder. Pitcher, I would say Nolan Ryan. No explanation needed. Nolan Ryan for sure. Infielder, I would go Jackie Robinson because you want someone who can, uh, you know, be, he can do everything, you know, fast, can run, can hit. This is tough because I, I feel like you want someone on both sides of the plate, a uh, switch hitter, right? Because my first choice, I would have said Ken Griffey Jr. But then I thought about it and I was like, maybe you want someone who can hit from both sides of the plate. So I would say Mickey Mantle. So, yep. Yep. That's all, that's all I got. All right, man. And we've got from the Angels, a 1969 World Series champion, eight-time All-Star appearances, and the most important, the 11-time strikeout leader, 92 overall starting pitcher, Nolan Ryan. Thank you. God, we got a pitcher here. I was getting a little concerned that we weren't going to get one because I didn't actually tell people to give me a pitcher. But I'm glad we got it. Nolan Ryan. Was he the guy that played on acid? Or was that Roger Clements? Someone did acid. Maybe it was me. Hello, Troy Dan. This is Bo Jackson. Hey, man. I was thinking if I was going to form a fantasy Major League Baseball team, three players that I would have on that team – it's a hard choice because there's so many. I played with a few. I just from the past. I would go number one, Hank Aaron. Number two, George Brett. Number three, Ken Griffey Jr. Those would be the three players that I would pick. I hope that's good enough for you, brother. God bless. And we've got from the Kansas City Royals. He is. World Series champion, an MVP, a Gold Glove Award winner, and 13 times in the All-Star Game, 94 overall third baseman, George Brett. I'm glad we have a true third baseman out here, Mr. Brett Hart. Mm, I'm feeling good. We're getting a good team here. This is a very, very good team, Ka. Hello, Troy. Then how are you? This is Ivan Post Rodriguez. Uh, how are you doing? Okay. I send you this video um, answering your your question about the three players. I think you should pick uh, Vladimir Guerrero, Fernando Tatis Jr., and I think you probably say Jacob Dubron because I always wanted to have a pitcher in there. I know he's a lot of good ones, but Jacob Dubron, best pitcher in baseball. I think Fernando Tatis and Vladimir Guerrero Jr. are doing a great job. So there is a question, there is the answer, and hope you're doing okay, and good luck on that. God bless, buddy. Bye-bye. And we've got from the Toronto Blue Jays, he is an all-star. He will be a five-time MVP, a 10-time home run leader, and a 15-time stolen base leader when it's all said and done. happy this guy is going to go down as the greatest hitter ever guaranteed the future is his oyster oh so good so so good hey Troyton. so you want three baseball players for your fantasy squad so here we go all right first of all you got to go with a brave arguably the greatest player of all time hammer and hank hank aaron how could you not have hank aaron on your team okay secondly Grew up in Boston, a big Red Sox fan. Maybe one of the sweetest swings of all time, Ted Williams. How could you not have that guy in your team, right? And then lastly, you need a pitcher. So how do you not go with the winningest pitcher of all time in Cy Young? I mean, my God, they named it a pitching award after the guy. So he's got to be a guy you want in your team as well. So hopefully that helps. I know I'd like to have those three guys on my team. So there you have it. All right, good luck. And we've got sure what team that is. He is a World Series champion, a triple crown winner, and a five-time wins leader. 87 overall pitcher, Cy Young. Cy Young, a legend. I'm pretty sure they have an award for him for being very good at throwing the ball. I've heard this guy's name, but I haven't seen him play. Is he still alive? Is he still alive? He would have, oh no, he, he, he long dead. He would have been 154 today if he was still alive. 
What's going on? It's Kevin Pilar. Just reaching out, trying to help you out a little bit with your MLB show fantasy team. Uh, as far as players, uh, you should take my favorite player to watch right now, and I think he's the best player in baseball, Fernando Tatis Jr. Uh, I'm going to give you a guy that uh, is my best friend in baseball. Uh, he's over playing in Japan right now, Justin Smoke. And lastly, I will tell you to pick as far as like an old timer, uh, since you can take people from any generation, uh, my favorite player to watch uh, and the guy I idolized growing up, even though I'm from Los Angeles, was Cal Ripken Jr. So hopefully those three will get you uh, a lot of fantasy points. Uh, play Cal at third, obviously Fernando Tatis, put Justin in that first base DH spot, and I think you've got a pretty good start to your team. Uh, take care. Bye. And we've got from the San Diego Padres, he is an all-star, a silver slugger, and the all-MLB first team. 94 overall shortstop, Fernando Tatis Jr. He's just a young boy. He doesn't know he's not supposed to swing when it's a 3-0 count and the bases are loaded. He's learning. Don't hit him on the next pitch. It shouldn't be allowed. Fernando, there's a reason they call you the Steph Curry of baseball. Hey, Troyden. It's great to talk to you. Thanks for your question. The three players I would tell you to put on your fantasy team in the history of baseball, okay? It doesn't matter if they're playing today or they played back in 1900. I'm going to give you my three. Okay, one has got to be Hank Aaron. One has got to be Babe Ruth. And I'm going to put one on there you probably wouldn't think of. A guy that had great records, Stan Musial. Okay, Troyden, and I'll tell you what. You booked this for yourself, and I'm, and I'm happy to answer that question. But it's really unfair because there's so many more players that you could put on that list. What about Willie Mays, okay? What about Roberto Clemente? What about Lou Gehrig? What about Ty Cobb? What about all those great players? What about Jackie Robinson? Okay, Troyden, you booked this for yourself, and you did a good job. Thank you. And we've got from the Brooklyn Dodgers. He is a six-time All-Star, a World Series champion, an MVP, the Rookie of the Year, a batting champion, two-time stolen base leader, and the number 42 is retired in all of baseball. Second baseman, Jackie Robinson, one of the greatest legends we have out here today. I know there is a 99 overall Jackie Robinson, but you got to do single player to do it. And unless Timmy's going to actually do something, it's not happening. It's not happening, but I might do it just because Jackie's such a legend. I might do it. I might not as well. Hey, Troy. Mr. October here hitting you back. So you got the MLB show Diamond Dynasty team. And you want me to give you three players for your squad. If I could pick three guys, it would be Ruth... Aaron and Mays, Ruth, Aaron, and Mantle, and Mantle, Mantle, Mays, and Aaron, um, Lou Gehrig, Mays, and Aaron. I gotta have those three guys in there some way. Anyway, that's it, my friend. Good luck to you. <laughs> The New York Yankees, a seven-time World Series champion, a two-time MVP, the Triple Crown, the Gold Glove Award, a batting championship, four-time home run leader, and 20 All-Star appearances. He's damn good, 95 overall, Mickey Mantle. That's another name that just screams baseball. This is a very good team. I can't even complain. Looking at these guys right here, we're gonna be great, but there is one problem. We don't have a catcher. We don't have a catcher at all. So, uh, I wonder if Roberto's here. Let me just, uh, oh. Hi, Troyden, this is Robbie. Hey, uh, I know you asked me for three catchers for your MLB show 21 team. Pudge Rodriguez. Sandy Alomar Jr. and Jadiel Molina. Those are my three picks. Take care and good luck. And we've got from the Florida Marlins. He is 
a World Series champion, an MVP, a 13-time Gold Glove Award winner, seven Silver Slugger Awards as well, and 14 times in the All-Star Game, 92 overall catcher, Ivan Rodriguez. It's funny, we spoke to him earlier, and now we have him on our team. I was actually hoping he was gonna choose himself because I know it's harder to get a catcher out here, but we got them. We got a catcher. Thank you so much. Can always count on old Robbie. And this is the team that baseball players drafted. Center field, you knew he'd be here. That's Michael Trout. In left field, decided to put a little bit of that Mickey Mantle. In right field, we got the kick. Ken Griffey Jr., our shortstop, Fernando Tatis Jr. At second base, the legend, Jackie Robinson. Our third baseman, George Brett. Our first baseman, the power hitter, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. And our catcher, Ivan Rodriguez. And unfortunately, we only received two pitchers here. We have Nolan Ryan and Cy Young. If I have to take them out, I'm gonna be screwed. This is one hell of a baseball squad. I'm excited to use Gladdy Jr. I haven't even used the card yet. It just came out and I just spent a lot of money on it. And it's now time to go online to play a random. Where'd my record go? Where's my record? Man, they took my record. You should have seen it. I had an impeccable record, an impeachable record, impregnable record. And it just clued in I did not change my batting order at all. You know what? This looks fine. This looks good. I was going to put Vladdy at three anyway. I think the game knows more than I do. Right, let's see what we're playing against here. Hopefully, it's someone with a team not so good. What the hell? Okay. And we are live in Polo Grounds. Looks like a great day to play some baseball. Call. Who's that? All right, we are batting first. Oh, I thought we were in Polo Grounds. We were not. My apologies. We're also not using the right button controls. This is annoying. Mike Trout, 1-1 one, one count. Let's go. Let's start strong here. It's been a minute, but I'm ready. I'm ready! Come on, come on. That would have been a great start. It's going to be okay, though. Bat second, the kid, Ken Griffey Jr. Let's send it long. I'm, I'm gonna send it to the green monster. That's right. It's gonna go over there on uh, in the street. I think that's the street, the street, the street. Why is the second baseman doing over there? Vladdy Jr., the power hitter. This is going to the moon. That's right, we're gonna send this so far, you'll never find it. Come on, Vladdy, let's go. Oh, come on. These nuts. Okay. All right, not a great start uh, swinging the vine, but it's early, you know, we just gotta brush the cobwebs. We're great at pitching though. Nolan Ryan, exceptional. Let's go right here. We're gonna throw our first pitch of the game. Beauty. I smell a lot of those coming. 0-2 count, looking for our first K of the game. Let's do it, Nolan, right here. I got a good curve for you. Mm -hmm. Just one! Give me a K! First K of the game. Jesus, taking his time. First K of the game. All right, I like the way we're starting off here. Nolan Ryan, very impressive pitcher. I think he was something special in his day. Ooh, we got a one-two count. Looking for our second K of the day. We're rocking a perfect one. Watch this, fastball. Got you! K, K, that's two, baby. Oh, two, looking for our third K. Come on, right here, curveball. Got you, okay. Give me a K, give me another K. Three strikeouts. Jackie Robinson, oh, oh. Oh, Jackie, go, go, ball travel. Ah, oh, you are so lucky. He's named after Mickey Mouse. Go oh, off you. All right, perfect game for both of us so far. All right, he's got Vladdy Jr. at the plate here. I gotta be careful. I know that guy can send it pretty far. Good pitch. Oh, great pitch. Two, two count. We're looking for our fourth K. I'm gonna try to get him with a curve here. Come on, Nolan. Come on. Good pitch. Woo! Got you! Give me a K, 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 K. The fourth, baby! He's like fake haunted now. He doesn't know what to do. I hit him! I hit. I just blew a perfect game by hitting. All right, that's embarrassing, but whatever, dude. Come on. Oh, Jesus. Now he's on second, you cheater. Come on. Ah, please. Damn it! This guy's got the third base. All right, he's got a runner on third. Let's try to get the K here. Are you kidding me right now? 
Are you kidding me? Gotcha, <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Don't play stupid with me, car. That's what you get. Let's get rid of his perfect game now. Fernandez Tatis Jr. Oh! That's... Oh, man. Sometimes it looks like it's gonna go really far in a dungeon. It's, uh, it's kind of annoying. We are still looking for our first hit today. We have Ivan Rodriguez stepping up to the plate here. Come on, Irod. That's his new name, Irod. I, I just made it up. Oh, come on, come on. No! Ah, we cannot. Oh, this, I cannot get a hit yet. Come on, Nolan. Focus, Nolan. Come on, Nolan. Oh, no way. Ah, oh, it looked for our fifth K right here. Fastball up top. Woo! Gotcha, baby! One, two, three, four, five. Five K, five K special. We're gonna bunt. We're gonna bunt, bunt this, boy. I'll tell you to bunt this. Give me it! Six Ks. We have six strikeouts. All we need to do is get some offense now. Three, one count. Vladdy Jr. at the plate. Come on. Is he gonna walk me? Or do that! Come on! Go! 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 No! I want it! Damn it, dude! I'm. I'm coming so close, but I can't come hard enough. Let's throw a fastball right here. 2-2. Two, two. That's what I'm talking about. Seven Ks. I'm striking them out. Going for another K. We're going to throw a curve to the dirt. Come on. Work, work, work. No, stop. Eight Ks. Eight, eight. For Kobe. 1-0 count. Jackie Robinson. Come on. Ah, please hit. Yes. Sorry, hit the mic. We finally got a hit. I'm so excited. Finally. We got a 3-1 count. Tatis on the plate. Jackie on first. Oh! I, I was all... Oh, I can't believe I was too late on that. All right, come on. Full count. Let's do this. Do this. Do this. Damn it! You stink. Oh, one Aaron Judge. Come on, Noli. That's a good pitch. No! No, that was his first hit. There goes the no-hitter. We got an 0-2 count. Judge on third, or on first. Woo! Got you, baby! Nine, nine, nine Ks, baby. 2 we're looking for another K here. Fastball top. Woo! Got just through 10 Ks. 10! Two outs, 2-2. Two, two. Mike Trout, top of the six. Come on, we gotta get some scoring. Oh! oh, oh. Green Jones! I get it! This is the greatest card in the game, I'm telling you right now. Macau Trout. We're looking for our 10th K right here. We're gonna throw a change up to the dirt. Come on, Nolan. Come on. Woo! 11! 11 Ks, baby! We got a 1-2 count. Nolan Ryan right here looking for another K. Let's get it, Nolan. Let's get it. Or not. Whatever, dude. An out is an out. Still Look at all the graffiti on that. Good lord. What? Where'd he go? <laughs> Dude, I. Ba -ba 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 a win is a win is a win is a win. A little anticlimactic, boy. Hey, man. I exposed him. Coats 45, this game is not for you. Stick to Fortnite. And there we have it the team that baseball legends drafted. And now, I got a question for you. Is this team a W, L, or an N? An N means neutral, and N means you don't care. It's a W, okay? The only thing that could be improved is the Jackie Robinson. I should probably, you know, do single player. I think there was another card. Who was the other card? Willie Mays and Hank Aaron. I think there's a better one. I don't know how to get them. Let me know if uh, I should do it or not. I, I really don't know if it's worth my time. Either way, we got the win, and that's the only thing that matters in life, kids. Winning. Don't let anyone tell you differently. And if they do, kick them in the nuts. Thank you for watching, and as always, keep your stick on the ice.